Christmas has come early this year. Hey everyone, it's Jade from Boho Bookworm. How are you all? I hope you're all having a lovely festive season. It's been a weird one for me being, you know, in this new country, being relatively alone and realising that for the most part, you know, Christmas isn't just a day, it's an entire season. And for the most part, I am spending Christmas alone. So I find that very hard. It's my first time I'm doing it. And I'm slowly figuring things out and becoming a bit more independent. I got my very first Christmas tree, which is this really little cute like knee high uh, fiber optic one. Um, yeah, you know, I've had Christmas trees with ex-boyfriends and stuff in the past, but never one of my own. And when I realized that I'm spending Christmas alone this year, I was just like, you know what? I've just got to do it. It's not where I thought I'd be in life at almost 30, but it's the direction that life has <laughs> taken me in. So here we are. I signed up to this group of people, murderinos who all love true crime, and it's a group on Facebook of like people that have wish lists on Amazon. And I thought that it might be quite a lovely thing to do, get involved with the community. And also, you know, I don't have family to go to or, you know, family giving me Christmas presents. Well, they haven't given me Christmas presents in years, but you know what I mean? Like, I just thought, oh, you know what? Like, let's just sign up for it. It might be a bit of fun. And I am so overwhelmed by how many parcels I've received. I have got, let me show you. I just, I can't believe it, to be honest. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight bloody parcels. I mean, I am really feeling the love right now. We'll pop these back on the table so we get the, Chris, the fireplace in the background because I think that's lovely. But I'm just like, I'm so happy. And I, did, I just didn't know if it would really work. And I am just so overwhelmed by the generosity and kindness that people have in their hearts, especially, you know, for someone like me that's relatively alone this year. It's been a, a rough couple of days, which is probably why you haven't seen me around this corner of the internet for a little while. But moving swiftly along, let's get into the presents. I don't know what to open first, I'm just so excited. Right. I got, and it's anonymous, there's not even a note with it. Oh, I've got Monopoly Deal, which is a card game for, I think it's for two people. Someone had told me that if you, yeah, two to five players. If I was looking for games that two people can play together, because my boyfriend and I are honestly like, <sighs> not being very creative with things that we can do. So, some lovely person got me Monopoly Deal. Whoever you are, thank you so, so much. I'm gonna love this. I think he's coming over later, hopefully, and hopefully we can just get over this depressing stage of just lockdown England vibes and play a fun game and have a nice evening. God knows if that'll happen, but let's see. Ooh, it's a bag in the back. A laundry bag. Is this on my wish list? I don't know. Oh, I know what this is. It's for like, so you put your, you can separate your clothes. So you can do, put your underwear and stuff into them. And there's like all these little different packs. This is something I have actually been wanting because I like, I don't know, I just want to put my underwear in one place and wash them and then everything else is separate. I just think it's nice, especially, you know, when you're living with a partner, which I'm not anymore, but um, yeah, I just really like this. They use them a lot on the yachts as well to separate their clothing. So thank you, this is lovely. I'm really, really happy with that. And again, I don't know if there's a note. Oh wait, here we go. A gift note from Caroline. Welcome to the group, glad we found you from Caroline. That's so lovely. Yeah, so it's a mesh laundry bag, uh, washing machine, wash bag, reusable and durable mesh for delicates like blouses, um, 
underwears, bras, lingerie, baby clothes, that kind of stuff. And it is, yeah, I, I put this on my wish list quite a while ago, actually. I'm so pleased. What's this one? This is honestly like the best Christmas I've had for a very long time because I don't get Christmas presents from anyone. <laughs> This gift is from a lady called Helen and she says welcome to the group. So I'll just hide her surname so you can't see that, but I'll show you what the uh, messages look like. So I use, it's so sweet and people can just be so giving and so thoughtful. Oh, I can already tell what this is. This is the um, LED lights for Christmas that I was hoping for. Oh, yay, just to add some like Christmas spirit. Got like little LED lights and it's even got a little remote control. Oh, I'm so excited. Definitely gonna put these up. I do have a, a Christmas tree coming on, like a really big one, like six foot, coming on Friday. So really excited to put these on my Christmas tree, I think. Ah! Keep the instructions just in case because I am pretty technologically challenged. You know what? I might have to take this thing off my head because it's getting really hot on this fire. Woo! Let's take this off. Oh, that's better. All right, let's see what's next. This one, I think this might be one of the uh, 2021 calendars that I was really looking forward to getting. I don't even mind which one it is, I'm just so excited. not from my wish list but it's so cute what is it they look like stickers let's make a look with this one i wonder if it's like things for your window oh my goodness they are so cute they must be for your window yeah a little Santa, a little snowflakes, I don't know if you can even see them in this lighting. Lots of little snowflakes. I'm going to put these on my window and then never be able to get them up because it's not going to be what I think it is. But I'm pretty sure that this is for your window. Right? They're adorable. Oh, we absolutely love them. Decorating my window tonight. Alright, we've got a few boxes left. Where do you open this one? <laughs> Come on. Right. As you can tell, I do not get many presents off them because I don't know how to open them. This one's from Hannah. The gift train has arrived. Lots of love from Hannah. So this was the uh, the actual gift train that we were doing. So you have to gift the person below you in the comment section. And if you're feeling generous, like obviously so many of these people were, um, you can gift other people as well. And you know, in the future when I'm a bit more financially stable, I will definitely be doing more of that because you've just got to show your appreciation for the things that people do. Let's have a look. What is it? Ooh. Oh my god, I have always wanted one of these. It's a three blade spiralizer. Like a, um, so you can slice your vegetables. So say you've got like a zucchini, you can make zucchini spaghetti really easily. Oh, I am so happy about this. Thank you so much. Absolutely love it. I might be here a while. <sighs> White chocolate lint balls. Oh my effing goodness. Where are 
these from? From Vicky. Oh, Vic Victoria, thank you so, so much. These aren't my favourite chocolates. Oh, I feel so lucky right now. That they actually make me want to cry. <laughs> All right. Oh, this one's a bit, a little bit heavier. What's this one? This one is from Jen. Welcome to the Wishlisterino family. Oh. What is it? What is it? Ooh. <laughs> I need the scissors for this one. Fuck. Oh my god. I think this is like one of the first things from my wish list, which I must have put on there like a year or so ago. I wanted this mug for so long. <laughs> Please do not annoy the writer. She may put you in a book and kill you. Jen, thank you so much. This is going to be what I drink my coffee out of every morning now. Love it. Absolutely love it. And I'm busy writing another book at the minute. Funnily enough, it is a, uh, not a thriller, it's a romance. So uh, something a bit different for me. So this is going to be absolutely lovely to drink my coffee in. Oh, I love it. All right, this is the last one. Let's see what it is. Oh my god, I know what these are. This is actually a gift for my boyfriend for, <laughs> for Christmas. Oh, they're so brilliant. They're yellow socks with pictures of his actual dog, Jim, on them. Oh my god, they're brilliant. I hope he doesn't watch this because he is perfect. What a cool present. <laughs> I'm just such a tip with buying silly gifts like that. So that's lovely, something a little different and quirky. My boyfriend loves like colourful stuff and this is his dog, so I hope he likes them and finds the humour in it. The quality is really nice actually. Like, you can literally see the dog perfectly. <laughs> okay, I mean, that has been such a successful little haul. I am so happy, really I am. Thank you to everyone that just made me feel special this Christmas. I'm like, you know, I'm not alone. Let's uh, do a final. So besides the, <laughs> the random socks I got my boyfriend, we've got, please do not annoy the writer. She may put you in a book and kill you. We've got, and I've tried to put all of the little notes from everyone like there um, with each present so I can thank everyone individually. We've got the lovely lint chocolate which I'm, I don't know if they're going to last very long I'm going to dive right into them. Little spiralizer which I cannot wait to use. Oh I'm so excited. These little window decorations I might try and put one of those up now to see what it's like. My fairy lights. Monopoly deal, which I can't wait to play. I, I don't know what it is or how to play it, but looking forward to learning. And then my little laundry bags, which I'm so, so excited for. Just makes doing my laundry so much easier. Awesome. <laughs> I'm so happy. Right, I'm gonna attempt to put up one of these snowflakes. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're for the window. Let's have a look. I don't know if this is how you do it, but surely just go like that and then peel off later. Right? <laughs> Let's put Santa up, shall we? There might be a bit of tricky ones to fiddle with. Right, 
right, so I've put like a couple up. I think we're going to take a walk outside and see what it looks like before I put the others up. Oh, I'm so excited. Let's go. Time to wrap up. Otherwise, I will freeze to death within seconds of being outside. Oh, God, I so hope we can see them. It'll be so exciting. Just like, it feels so nice to be able to decorate my own, you know, house and just be that independent person and have Christmas regardless. Like, not let it get me down. And yes, I am walking onto the high street in my slippers. Focus. Okay, so my camera wasn't exactly playing nice with me. Um, it's pretty blurry, but yes, you can see them. It looks awesome. So I'm happy. I'm really, really stoked. Yeah, once again, I just... Thank you to everyone who made me feel really special today. It really does mean the world to me.